<clears throat> so is all these black areas the places we haven't been? Uh, those are other floors, I think. See, like, go back. See that that one right there that's blacked out? Go, yeah, that one. Then if you go to the next floor, or get the other way, see, it's that, that part. So we missed something in the engine room. Yeah. That's B4, so let's go to B4. Okay. Alright, hello everybody, and welcome back to Resident Evil Village. We are on B4. We're on part 17. And we're still working to escape from Heisenberg's factory. Um, but soon we will have accomplished that. And because, you know, we're awesome and stuff, and we do... We can do anything. Isn't that right? Yeah. Yes, that is right. Now we've been through the engine room a couple of times. And haven't found what's left in there. So I don't know if we'll be able to now. We can even get back to the engine room. Well, this is all red. Yeah. Oh, okay. Now there was a yellow cable on the on the ground, but on the floor. You, uh, often they lead to something important. See, that says we got everything here. I never find it.
get over there. There. Maybe. Yeah. Wait, turn around. Oh, never mind. Okay, we're going away from it now, so. Oh well, we just won't get it. Yeah, that's fine. We got good stuff. We don't need it, whatever it was. Well, we did. There was money that we saw. Well, that's fine, we don't need it. Let's just get out of here. Shot him in the arm. <laughs> I don't think he was bothered by it. There's a lot we missed. Do we have shotgun shells? No. Seeking something in particular. Yes, shotgun shells. And he sold out of them. All right. Till next we meet. I guess we'll stick with the Magnum, for which we only have two rounds, but better than nothing. You unlocked it. Good job. You really are a tough one. Running time. Indeed. Time to die. You can Why? Hear it, can't you? Someone. Waiting for you. Prototype Sturm. Used the cheap turboprop engine, but he's impossible to control. All he does is charge. Too much power output from the reactor? Completely invincible head on, but the dumbass managed to chop his own damn arms off on the propeller. Also, issues with overheating from running for long periods of time. Conclusion a complete failure. We've and him a time or two. Yeah. Shotgun ammo. Sweet. <sighs> Those are just flashbangs, so they're probably not doing much damage. No! Shoot Gotta shoot him in the back. You see his red spot?
Oh, he's gonna charge. Or explode. What did he do? I don't know what he did. Is he throwing flames? Did he charge? What happened? I don't know what. Eh. I think his back is his only weak spot. Oh, he's throwing fire. That's not cool. Try the sniper rifle on him. Oh, so he's probably going to shoot fire again. Oh no.
Control! I didn't know he was I, was, I was wondering if you saw him. Seem to be doing fine. Well, decent. <clears throat> okay, so he's on fire again. This is the third time, so maybe he'll be ready to die after this. Hopefully. Stay down. Go, get him. You did it. Where to go? Complex <clears throat> mechanical heart you have now. Okay. That was a bit stressful. Yep. You want to reload your knife? I tried. Okay. Got a cigar. Miranda is abominable. Her deceit knows no bound. We're merely a bunch of failed Kadu experiments to her. I was just lucky I had more affinity to the stuff than the other poor schmucks in the village. So she still calls me her son. What a joke. I'll never forgive her for what she did to me. That crazy bitch has never been right in the head. She can't see a difference between experiment and family. Miranda didn't just change my body. She took my dignity. If I don't, if I don't kill her, then my life will never be my own. Still... She may be crazy, but she's also powerful. She can turn into anything using the Megamycite. My, mega, megamycite. The trick is that brat rose. If I could access her power, then maybe. Speaking of, the kid's dad, Ethan, has a pretty interesting body himself. Maybe I could get him to help me out. That wasn't bad once you figured out, like, what he was doing. Yeah. That's the way they always are. <clears throat> I mean, they can still be bad even af after that, but... Um, it's much better once once you figure out... Oh, there's something up their there. patterns. Have I been there? Uh, I don't know. Can I get back up? That also, I do not know. Maybe.
Careful, don't fall. Yeah. So does that mean that he's going to let us leave? As Possibly. As, seems like as long as we don't come back, you know, he's fine with us. Which is cool. We can go. You know, if we just leave, I, I guess we won't get Rose back, but, you know, that's kind of a long shot anyway, maybe. And, uh, you know, is she really worth it? I don't think she is. Yeah, probably not. She's just a little baby with a weird head, so. I don't know if I would save her. Yeah. I mean, she's already been flasked. It's hard to come back from that. So we should probably just, you know, cut our losses and um, Go head home. home. Yeah. Oh. I told you to leave it alone, Ethan. In the way. What do you care, Chris? You killed my wife, you son of a bitch! You think I killed Mia? That wasn't her. It was Miranda. What? Mm. She's a bioweapon. She changed her appearance and pretended to be Mia. Seems she also survived being shot, so now I'm here to finish the job. Bullshit! Why don't you fucking tell me right away? Because I knew you would want to be involved! And this job is hard enough without civilians getting in the way. Why us, Chris? What? what the hell is going on? All right, Ethan. All right. I guess I owe you an explanation. Hmm. Yeah? Hand me that wrench. You're not going to hit me with it, are you? They hit me with it. <laughs> Long story short, Miranda's fucking insane. In this village, all these monsters and freaks, this is her life's work. Some sort of crazy experiment with the mold. The mold. Like Louisiana. God damn it. All this time, I thought I could save my family. I can't escape from here. I can't do anything! That might not be true. Take a look at this. My men sent those pictures a few minutes ago. Miranda. Keep looking. I like how he just throws the phone. Rose. Holy shit, we gotta go! Relax, my men are monitoring the situation. But they have my daughter. You don't get it, Ethan. You don't stand a chance against Miranda by yourself. Andrew got his dad.
I will stay down here well, and finish planting explosives. You take mostly that elevator, dead. I'll meet you topside. I promise you, we will get your daughter back. Together. Damn straight we will. And when I find her... Together? She's a dead woman. <clears throat> Alright, Ethan. Then you take this. And do me a favor. Try to stay under the radar. I'm gonna stay under the radar over that thing. <laughs> Can't turn back now. Two Hound Wolf Squad. The sweep of the factory is complete. No proof of any connection with the organization. Guess this just wasn't our lucky day. I did manage to get my hands on a number of documents disclosing some of Miranda's experiments which support our previous theories. She seems to have infected herself with a mutamycete, which has mutamycete, which has granted her a number of abilities, including mimicry. She can control herself and transform herself to look like any anyone or anything. She disguised herself as Mia and infiltrated the Winters' home. Her objective was. <laughs> Her objective was clearly to kidnap. I think that should be the Winter Sisters' home. Her objective was clearly to kidnap Rose. Maybe she thought she could control Rose easier if she looked like her mom. When we attacked, it put a little damper on her plan, so she mimicked a corpse. Then she revived herself in the transport truck, killed everyone on board, and took off with Rose. Things didn't go the way she had originally planned, but in the end, she still got what she wanted. Until now, it's time to rendezvous and blow this place sky high. This might turn into a fight with Heisenberg, but I think I found something useful. He left one of his little toys laying around, and it's even made from a metal polymer composite, which he can't control. Time to turn the tables, Alpha. You're going down, Heisenberg. I thought he could only control meth. So Chris, upon shooting Miranda, who was disguised as Mia, decided not to tell us that it was actually Miranda disguised as Mia because he thought that that would keep us from getting involved Yeah. by thinking, Metal polymer composite. leading us to believe, to fire with fire. <clears throat> leading us to believe that he killed her wife I'm coming, Rose. is what would make us want to stay out of this. So where is she? Any idea? Mm -mm. <sighs> well, then has Rose actually been flasked, or is that just it may not Miranda be Rose. disguised as Rose disassembled and put in the flasks I mean, to throw us off for some reason? There could be nothing in the flask. There could be. Maybe there never was a rose. Maybe rose was a figment of our imagination, a side effect of the mold, which we probably have in us to a large extent. And if rose is not not real, that would explain uh, her head. What? Right, look. Oh, I can't sprint in this. This is like battle bots. I don't know. 
This is the best! Sometimes he calls him calls her Miranda, sometimes he calls her Miranda. Why it goes back and forth. But that's the way it sounds now. You dead already? I'm not sure how to like defend myself. Ugh. I'm trying. Can you block? Okay. Saw something in the grass. Don't die like the world's watching. Something Here we else. go. The final stretch. Well, what do you think? It's home. I think I really hate you. Right? Shoot. Just give up. Flesh and blood will never win against me. This is a deed for the Goliath. It's Ethan. <laughs> no, I'm not sure what to shoot at. Uh, looks, looks like you're sh shooting at the right thing. supposed to happen. So I wasted all the ammo? Yeah, you wasted some there. But it's okay. Didn't waste too much. Ah, no! Oh, but it can. 
I mean, I get that. I get wanting to kill Miranda. I don't know why you want to kill us, though. I'm not, not entirely sure about that. We could work together. Ethan? I heard explosions. What the hell happened? I dealt with Heisenberg. Oh, you know. Now I'm gonna find yeah. Miranda and get Rose back. Not without me. Easy peasy. It's too dangerous. Wait there, you hear me? Ethan? Rose? <gasps> Rose. I just killed. Oh, is this Miranda? I just killed Heisenberg in like three minutes. No, this is Miranda. Don't fall for it. She's so important, isn't she? She's everything to me. <laughs> That's not what Mia would say. And mine to me. With Heisenberg gone, you've lost your lead. What are you going to do? I don't know, but I'm saving Rose. You'd never know, do you? Even when I took Mia's place in your home. Poor Ethan. Who are you? Where's Rose? <laughs> <laughs> She's obviously Miranda. Come on, Ethan, keep up. Why did you shoot her? It's too busy being dumb. Enough yourself. Remember Evelyn and her power over them all? Rose no. is Oops. her successor. No. Evelyn. Rose is Evelyn's <gasps> true, complete form. I remember Evelyn. She will grow oh, fully. Oh, right, Grandma. Or little girl. And I slash Grandma. Fuck you, you crazy bitch! Calm yourself. Rose will be saved. The Mega My Seat catalogs all of us. However, she will be reborn as my daughter. She's my child, not yours. Where are you? Show yourself. Why did Rose <clears throat> come to be? Was it because of her parents? And you are truly a special case. But I've learned all I can from you. Your worth as a lab rat has run out. Miranda, you coward. Come out and face me! Don't worry. You're supposed to be fun. Uh-huh. You will join the Mega My Seeds records. I will make sure to sample your blood for later. Once dawn breaks, the ceremony will be complete, and I will become her true mother! Bound for eternity in blood. <laughs> goop, goop. You get your yeah, heart back. Goop hard. I've waited so long. But dreams really can come true. Vessel or not, I can't wait to see my true child again. So where do I go from here? <laughs> I'm I'm dead. I guess I guess that's it. We're just dead. Probably could have used one of those mechanical hearts if we hadn't sold them all. Could just <gasps> stitch those in. Oh. Pour a little bloop, 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 splashy splash and bada bing bada boom baby. <laughs> but um, we sold them, so I guess that's it. So we lost. Um, yeah, I guess we're done. <laughs> None of the boss fights have been, like, impossible. Captain, I've confirmed the death of Ethan Winters. I wasn't able to retrieve the body, but I've recorded evidence. Share your screen, and I'll go over the situation. My team and I were careless. Yesterday, we took down the transformed Miranda, but we didn't kill her. Who knew she could fake being a corpse? Since Miranda could have infected Ethan, I forcefully took him and Rose with us. But the vehicle they were riding in was attacked. When I got to the wreck, Ethan and Rose were gone. The last time 
I was able to contact Ethan. I heard Miranda's voice. She murdered him. And she is not gonna get away with it. So I guess God we're heading now. When does it end? What's that, sir? Never. All of it. Three years trying to put this thing in the ground. Three years too long. Yeah. SAA got here already. They didn't waste any time. Mission adjustment? No, doesn't change anything. Terminate Miranda and rescue Rose. That's the mission. And failure's not an option. Let's have some fun, people. Like old times. Move out. Roger. Okay. K9, I want to know what the hell BSAA is doing here. Find out what you can. Roger that. I'm on it. Since we fought together, Captain. What, well, 300? The desert? Doing nothing but recon's gotten me out of shape. Not for long. But thanks to your recon, we know Miranda's plan. Couldn't quite believe it when I heard she turn herself into Mia, though. Taking five shots to the head's nothing to sneeze at, either. Spooky. the objective first we're gonna have to take that thing out I've got your back boss let's get to work everyone watch for hostile bio weapons roger all right so before we get too far into this, do you want to keep going? Or you... <coughs> I want to keep going. Okay. So I'm trying to take do that down. How about we stop here and then we'll pick back up? Is this a safe spot? Make contact sure with a group of hostile bioweapons. Oh shoot, sorry. Watch out. I'm sorry. Alright, we can stop right here. Okay. So that's gonna do it for this part. That's going to do it for this part, and we'll be back in part 18? Or is this 18? Is this 17? Something. This is 17, right. Yeah, we'll be back in part 18 to carry on as Chris and destroy Miranda interface and, you know, whatever and stuff. Be hero. So, yeah. So, thanks for watching. Hope you come back for the next part. And if so, until then, toodaloo.